All right, so here's gear load out for a couple of weeks on the road. Uh, probably number one question I get about, you know, what I'm wearing, gear I'm taking. So, so here we go. Uh, I'm going to be doing a bunch of carbine classes. So that's a gun, 11 and a half inch BCM, SBT brace in the back, keeping it legal. Uh, Spark AR from Vortex. And uh, I'm sorry, Spark Solar AR. So you got the backup panel right there. Bobro mount, uh, micro 3x magnifier, Vortex as well, and um, fresh battery, you know, um, Surefire Vampire Head, fresh battery, doing some pistol classes as well, so Staccato C2, fresh battery in the hollow sun, uh, you know, gotta have a lid, because I'm a bald dude. And a couple problems we got here. Uh, my boots got a couple of holes in them. They're just kind of old. So put some glue on there, some shoe goo. We're trying to get through with that. If I can hit an REI or something on the way, I might pick up a new pair. I'm going to get pretty much crushed. Uh, there's going to be, let's see, of these, I think it's five or six total classes. Um, two of them are going to be for sure wet the whole time and then um, possibly a third one but anyway we'll see what we can do with that that's a La Sportiva TX, TXS um, I generally consider that probably one of the better boots I've had in a long time I go through a pair of boots every year so I'm looking at a new boot company that you know more on that later if I find out but um, another problem I got this is my super lightweight down jacket uh, that I got from Mountain Hardware um, so obviously got a hole in it um don't know what i'm gonna do about that yet either so kind of in limbo on that one uh coming over here uh ammo wise uh nine mil i'm taking um high desert cartridge nine mil i'm shipping on my 556 five, so that'll be there waiting on me all high desert cartridge i'm doing a 115 grain uh nine mil and the 55 grain for the uh 556. So right here is new. This is my new belt, uh, overbelt system. It's a Farland holster. This is all Kafaru. So it's a Kafaru belt. Uh, this is the Kafaru Rogan belt system. So that's the Rogan pouch, uh, water bottle pouch or a dump pouch right there. Those are just tacos. Uh, the Rogan belt, um, that's probably the best kept secret going on right now for um, what I consider an overbelt, just because it's so damn comfortable, and that Rogan pouch, man, this thing is is bomber. Uh, you can hold timer in it, markers, pad, pen, snacks, water bottle, whatever. Um, pad it on the inside. So that's my new that's my new jam. Now, typically, I won't wear this uh, unless it starts raining. It starts raining real hard. I put the Gore-Tex suit on. That'll go over the top, and I'll convert from concealed carry to outside the waistband just you know safety and you can get better reps in when it's doing that um for the le classes i will wear this because the law enforcement guys obviously that's kind of holster they're wearing uh as far as the rain because it's i'm gonna be in it um i don't know what the model of these pants are they're arcteryx super lightweight i'll tell you that the key here though is the the hooks for the boot laces on the on the cuff of the pant you can get away with with a lot with those but they're super lightweight like summer weight but definitely waterproof my jacket is a old black diamond sharp sharp end shell um super lightweight not not it's still three layer but but definitely waterproof ops core ear pro uh all my timers fresh batteries in them uh this is another one from kafaru i found so um this is the kenosha duffel so this is kind of like, you know, in and out of the hotel kind of deal. All my clothes are in it. So uh, this thing is, is the bomb. Um, as far as the size goes, tough to beat. If you, if you can't get two weeks of clothes in there, you just you don't know how to pack. Um, so kind of go through here. Um, and all the Kafaru stuff, you know, the belt and, and the bag, it's all made in USA. Uh, USA materials and made by Americans. This is just, you know... The if you get sick kit um because i don't have time to to get sick so that's what that is that little pouch right there is chargers and stuff for the phone 
a uh, little beanie because I'm going to be dealing with some cold temps. I got that from Kafaru as well. I think they might have thrown that in with everything. Um, so this this layer right here, this is a Sitka, uh, kind of a kind of a base layer, if you will. But um, I use this hunting in Wisconsin in November, December. Uh, really warm. It's got a hoodie, and um, that'll probably be my my backup since my my jacket's kind of kind of torn. It's going to end up just just going to shit anyway. So. Uh, John Barklow uh, from Sitka kind of recommended this to me. If you don't follow his page, you might want to look at it because he's got way better gear videos than this. Um, I always throw a Nalgene in there because you never know, like hotels or whatever, just need water. Um, these little um, these little packing cubes right here, I got these from Adi Gear. Um, again, made in America. So kind of take a peek at what's inside here. So just socks and stuff, uh, all darn tough. Um, you know, half and half as far as summer weight and then a little bit of cool weight because I'm going to deal with some semi-cool temperatures. Um, this right here, this is workout gear, you know, shoes, running shoes, going some runs, some Olakai flip-flops because, you know, you get over it at the end of the day. Um, PT gear in here. Uh, all Florence Marine X. That's my, my new jam on that. So Florence Marine X, um, if, if you don't know them, uh, there's a label. That's uh, John John Florence, uh, pro surfer, two-time world champion. He's got his own gear company now. Um, highly recommended. The, the, the trainer shorts, the trainer shirt, and then I use their uh, long sleeve UPF sun shirt. Um, you get stuck in the sun. And then main clothes here, um, nothing crazy. All pretty much, think of it all, you know, some t-shirts, handful of t-shirts, and then um, all my pants are Prometheus Design Works, lightweight, and then um, you know, like uh, sacks, underwear for the uh, for a layer. So all synthetic, so I can get wet. Not a big deal. Uh, Audi gear again right here. This is just a little pouch system for them. I use that. That's my shave kit So that's all Audi gear uh, That's kind of it. So hopefully that helps people out as far as uh, what's going on. You know what we're uh, What I'm wearing what I'm carrying so I'll be good from you know 40 degrees to 85 degrees